Does your furry friend take over your bed every night? It's time to reclaim your space while giving them the comfort they deserve with the coldest, cozy dog bed. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description to buy now on Amazon. Katie Price has admitted that she is an exhibitionist and loves getting her kid off in front of a camera. The glamour model, 46, opened up about her raunchy career in an episode of Best Magazine's podcast, Suddenly Single, that is yet to be released. During the podcast appearance, which will be available to listen to from Tuesday, the mother of five delved into her dating life, her struggle with body dysmorphia, and life in the public eye. Chatting to hosts Tim Vincent and Siobhan Wikes, Katie confidently said, I love getting my kid off in front of a camera. I'm an exhibitionist. I'm good at it. I love it. You can get any 20-year-old in front of the camera, and I'll wipe the s asterisk 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 out of them in a photo shoot, and that, I am cocky on. It comes just a few days after it was revealed that the model is charging her OnlyFans followers 53 pounds for a completely naked video of herself in the shower, one of her most expensive clips yet. She shared a teaser shot of herself in the shower with water splashing off her body with her fans as she plugged the video. Katie's fans already pay £12 a month for access to her X-rated page, but will need cough up the one-off fee in order to unlock the minute and a half long clip. She revealed that the new clip would be a totally naked shower video of herself, as she attempts to rake in cash to pay off her debts. Talking about being in the public eye, the OnlyFans model said, I like it for me. It's weird. I do it for me. I like to look in the mirror and think, yeah, elsewhere on the podcast, Katie remarked that her biggest downfall in life is men. My downfall in life, with everything, is men. If you took men out of the equation of my life, I'd have no dramas, no problems, nothing, she said. The star added, what do you want a man for? To be my best friend. But couldn't you have that with a girlfriend? No, because I like D asterisk asterisk K. She also lifted the lid on body dysmorphia admitting that although people often say they think she has it, she has always denied it. Reflecting, she said, but I probably do. I probably tick that box as well. Katie is currently looking for lucrative ways to make some extra money after a judge ruled at her bankruptcy hearing she must use half of her earning to repay her debts. In March, she became bankrupt for a second time after she failed to pay her taxes, saying the reason she has debts is because she went through a breakdown. Katie previously reached an agreement to settle her debts but ultimately failed to keep up with the payments, the court heard. Katie was first declared bankrupt in November 2019 over unpaid debts including mortgage arrears of £3.2 million. She was declared bankrupt for a second time in March over an unpaid tax bill of £761,994.05. One of Katie's latest projects will be her own Netflix series as she disclosed she will be working with the streaming giant. She told Mail Online, it's massive. I'm doing my life story for Netflix. I am actually doing a three-parter about my life for Netflix. The fee for the documentary will be a welcome boost to Katie's bank balance. In February, a court ordered her to forfeit 40% of her income from the adult subscription website OnlyFans for the next three years following a separate dispute over unpaid debt. The plastic surgery addict, who recently had her 17th boob job, has quite the life story for producers to get their teeth into. Katie began modeling for tabloid newspapers aged 18. After a brief relationship with footballer Dwayne York, at 21 she gave birth to Harvey, a disabled boy with complex needs. York has played no part in his upbringing, but national fame came after a stint on the reality TV show I'm a Celebrity, as the nation watched her whirlwind romance with pop singer Peter Andre, who she would later marry and share two children with. After the breakdown of her first marriage, Katie's personal life has been unstable with two further nuptials ending in divorce. But her foibles, from drug-taking to driving offenses, have only endeared her to fans who have made her one of the UK's best-selling authors. The mother of five also said that the streaming giant had signed up a high-profile producer-director to work with her on the project, but declined to name him. When David Beckham partnered with Netflix on a documentary about his life story and marriage to Victoria Beckham, Oscar Wilde.